can see you know, in the man, they're in a man to man, but it's very packed in. Shot clock down again. Oh boy, a bailout. Now, they have not gotten any breakouts in this game. Carry. <laughs> It'll fall. Basket and foul. Chance at the old school three point play for Carry. Well, that's the type of player is. He's a blow by player, and you got to come out under control that time. And Kithcart came out, gave up the activity this week for the players as far as games are concerned, finishing up finals. Inside to Robinson. It'll spin in and it'll go to the free throw line. And I think that's what's more upsetting than anything. This is third. Uh, you know, in a game like this, if Syracuse can stretch it out to a 10-point lead, that's a huge lead in a low-scoring game. Battle on the run. Crosses it over. Calculates the angle off the square. Not able to get it done that time. When well, it's, you know, once, once battle, I mean, he's talking to assistant coach Jerry McNamara, had some time to work with Frank Howard this week. The work that Tyus Battles put in is paying off as well. Final 50 seconds of the first half. This is the largest lead of the game for the Orange. Hughes trying to increase it with a three, top of the key. Like a little geography in the middle of the second half. Stiff. Trying to fake off balance shot from Stiff, and he got the roll. Quick oh. passing, knocked away by Brissett from Dickens. Dolajar to the court, it's off of the orange. Zone was really pushed up the floor, but a great recovery. Oh. Stiff kicks it out. <laughs> Much better execution against the zone. Mike, you said the first one to 50. Is that going to be the case for the Orange? They got there, but now the lead belongs to Old Dominion. Shot clock at five. Green pumps it up and hits a three. Yeah, and again, a, another possession that looked dead in the water for uh, Old Dominion. And, uh, again, just uh, standing around and, you know, dribbling, no ball movement, no people movement. Gross set. Knocking down the three ball. Like Brissett from deep as well. Talked earlier, that's not a huge part of his. See now Syracuse really extending the front half of that zone. Zick Bay underneath Carver. And if you can get past, you can get past that without a turnover.